My toxic trait is swiping my card. What's up guys? Hello, happy, happy, happy Sunday. If you guys are new here, hello, my name is Frida and nice to meet you. For today's video, I have another huge fall clothing haul for you guys and you guys already know what goes on on Sundays. We have hauls here every single Sunday and I'm really, really happy that you guys are enjoying all of the hauls that I'm putting out and that you guys are actually picking up the pieces because you and I can be twins. Like, isn't that fun? I think that's fun. I think that's fun. So anyways, for today's video, I picked up a couple of items from Shein that I honestly and personally love and I think that you guys would love. So if you would like to know what they are, just go and keep watching. As always, if you guys like this video, please give this video a big thumbs up. And yeah, anyways, let's go and get started. Alrighty guys, let's start off with what I'm wearing because like always, I like to wear at least one item to show you guys. I am a hoe for neutrals right now and that's why you see all this monochromatic look with some nudes and neutrals, just browns. I just get so much happiness from just like wearing a very neutral look right now and that's why I'm just kind of, that's all I wear now. This is so flattering on my body. I literally walked outside my door and my grandma finished taking a shower and she was like, wow, I'm sexy more. And I I was like, thanks Lola, I love you. Now if you do live in a very cold area, this is something that I wouldn't just step out of, you know, the house without even like a really heavy jacket. But if you guys are like, you know, having Friendsgiving, please limit it to like three or four, which I really hope you're not because, you know, the COVID cases are like literally a million in LA right now. But if you guys are, I feel like this is a cute outfit to wear for Thanksgiving if you're not the type of person to wear, you know, dresses. Moving on to the next item, Ooh, you guys, I have been picking up a lot of flannels lately. So the first flannel I have is this one here. It is a color block of black, white, and brown tan, beige, whatever you want to call it. And it is so freaking soft, you guys. Now, I haven't washed this. So I don't know how the material will feel like after you wash it. Because you know how sometimes like if you buy like a fuzzy jacket or like a fleece jacket, it feels super soft at first. And after you wash it, it's like... Ugh. Like, why is it not soft anymore? So I don't know if that's going to happen for this item, but I do have one flannel that I bought from Shein a while ago, like a couple hauls ago, and I've washed it a couple times. And honestly, I feel like it's gotten softer, especially on the inside, because the outside is like fleece line. The inside is, I don't know what we call this material, honestly. It's not as soft as on the outside. I'm pretty sure they have sizes, so this is a size medium. And honestly, I love, 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 love the fit. I'm pretty sure I could have gone with a size small and still have that like oversized fit to the whole flannel, but I kind of just like wanted to be safe and I got the medium. Up next, I got this other neutral flannel and this is probably my favorite one. I think it's just cause like it's lighter and there's a lot more white color to it and the colors are just amazing. And again, you have the same material, fleece on the outside. I don't know what the inside is, but like I said, I don't know if it's still gonna be the same material or like softness after you wash it. I really, really hope so. If not, then, I mean, you do get what you pay for. They were pretty affordable. I feel like these flannels are something that you will see me wear a lot in Vlogmas. Um, Vlogmas season is coming up, guys. It is coming up, and I am mentally preparing for it. Are you guys excited? Because I'm excited, especially because I... I got some plans for you guys for Vlogmas. Speaking of really soft fleas, you know, sweaters. So I got this fuzzy sweater and it says New York. I don't know if you guys know this about me. For my new subscribers out there, I actually lived in New York for three years. I was gonna say eight years, for three years. And then I moved out here in California. So it is kind of like my third home. So one being Philippines, two New York, and then like, third LA. I know for a fact that Princess Polly sells a sweater or at least like a couple years ago. I don't know if they're back but I got it because I really really wanted to get that sweater but I never like got around to picking it up and then when I saw it on Shein and for the price I was like um add to cart. It's so 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 soft. However this is the thing though. I feel like this is the kind of material that once you wash it it's not gonna be as soft anymore. So I'm probably just gonna wear it like right now and enjoy the softness, the coziness. And then if, you know, if it doesn't turn out well after I wash it, at least I've had the chance to already like wear it out. Moving on, I picked up this ribbed knit pants and oh my goodness, you guys, these pants are so 
freaking soft. I th they just, they, ugh. Like, I don't even know how to explain it, but you will see me live in these for the next couple of months. And they also make the booty look really nice. It's just ribbed. It just honestly flows down. It's super soft. The waistband is not like something that you tie and it gets tied in. The tie is just there for whatever. Um, however, it is pretty stretchy. I got this in the size. Oh, it's one size. For reference, my sizes are 34C bust, 25 inches waist, and I am 5'2". Up next, I have this set, but I believe you do pay them separately. Um, it is a sweater and a sweatpants set, and I really like the color. And I got this because it reminded me of the Robert Pattinson meme. Like, he's in a living room, and he's literally just like, in a brown set. Now this is a green set, but for some reason when I saw this, I was like, oh my god, that would be such a cool look to wear at the park. And also, I've just been having fun with my outfit whenever I go work out to the park. Like one time I look like Vice President Kamala Harris, the other time I look like a boxer, and today, or like whenever I wear this, I'm gonna look like Robert Pattinson. This is this waffle sweatshirt, and it is so cozy, you guys. It is so cozy. It is on the thin side like it's not super thick i honestly love 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 the color and for the bottom part it's just this again oversized pants and it's like waffle material and then you also have pockets which is nice and then it singes up on the bottom so i got this loungewear set and it is just like this super soft it's honestly not the greatest quality like i wouldn't recommend this for you guys to buy it honestly like i just got it because i thought it was cute and it's something that I can wear, but if there's something I really, really, really recommend you guys buy, it's the first couple of items I showed you, like the flannels. This item, I would rate it like a 6 out of 10, honestly, but this is just what it looks like. It's just this super soft, like, cropped top, and it has like this little, it reminds me of Snapchat, and then it's like wearing a hat, and the bottom, it's like shorts. Now, it's kind of cold right now, honestly, so I don't know if I'm going to be wearing this anytime soon. Up next, I picked up this ripped black long sleeve top, and this one is actually pretty cool, you guys. Like, I haven't seen, like, a design of this top before, so I was like, oh, that's kind of cute. So basically, it is this black ribbed long sleeve mock neck, and you have this zipper going diagonal, so it just goes across. So there are two zippers. You can zip from the the top to here and then also from the bottom to like the middle you guys will see on the try and how i kind of like style it i guess but i was like oh that's actually a pretty nice top and i don't have anything like it so i got it now speaking of black tops i picked up this faux leather or pleather halter top now i don't know why i honestly picked this up not because like i hate it but because like it's so cold right now, like I'm probably not gonna wear this anytime soon. But it's just like this black pleather top and it has these ties and it just goes crisscross. Honestly, it's super pretty. I really like how it makes this area look. Like I mentioned earlier, I recently got back to working out. I feel like I have been in and out of shape during this whole pandemic. Like I think I've been in and out of shape like three to four times now. And I'm getting tired of it. And now I just got back to my work routine. So I have someone that helps me work out at the park for safety. I'm not really comfortable with going to the gym yet. I do miss the gym and I do miss how Pilates and they have like outdoor, you know, amenities. But I'm just like not comfortable. So I feel like the park is the next best thing I have. So long story short, I have been working out. I work out three times a week. But next week, I think we're going to try to do four times a week. And I was like, ooh, I kind of want to get like new workout clothes. But these, these are like summer appropriate workout clothes. Now, if you do go to the gym, I'm pretty sure you can wear this. So I got these because I was like, oh, it's LA. It's not going to be like 43 degrees. Well, lo and behold, it was just like 42 degrees this morning. I actually bought two different colors, but like they're the same style. So the first one I have is like this mint green one or like muted green. And I really, really love the top because the top is like this. The little Curse cross neck, it is so flattering, you guys. It is so, 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 so flattering. So you basically just wear it like this and it crisscross. Obviously, the straps on the back, so on the front, you just see that little crisscross. Now, you guys know my issue with paddings from Shein. They're just, they're shitty. I just literally just toss them. And then the bottom is just a seamless bottom. Nothing much going on, but honestly, guys, quality-wise, 
quality wise like i would say these are like an 11 out of 10. and like i said i got them in two different colors but like same style i got it in this pink one and then the bottom is just this it goes all the way down so it's 60 percent nylon 35 percent polyester and five percent spandex if you guys really want to get the nitty gritty on like the material so the next workout sets i have are a dupe for the boo and t sets that they have i don't know if you guys have heard of boo and t but it is o poly's workout sets and honestly i've been on their website i've thought about buying them and then i saw it on shein just without the a logo so i was like okay wait let me try this first and ironically they actually emailed me asking to do a collaboration so we're in the middle of kind of like figuring out whether we want to move forward with the project i just sent them my collaboration rates and then just kind of like waiting for them to you know approve it and or like accept it or like counter it basically so i don't know if i'm gonna have a haul with them soon but we'll see hopefully it'll be really really cool but i have been browsing on the boo and tea website lately because i really really want to get like this specific set but i was like okay let me hold off on that and let me try these items from Shein. So I picked up two sets that is very similar to what I saw on Boo & Tee. Bottom, they're like shorts basically or biker shorts, but they're higher than biker shorts. And I got it in this like really nice muted purple color. And then the top is just like this crop top. Now I know a lot of like workout brands are coming out with this set already. So I just like wanted to try it. And honestly you guys, the quality of these are pretty freaking amazing for the amount that you pay for because I have bought items from Set Active before and they're the exact same material. And the items from Set Active are like 40 and up, maybe even to like till 90. So it is kind of a lot of money. You guys don't have the budget for it. So if you guys are looking for Set Active dupes or even like Bow and Tee, like I think this is this is it. Like, this is honestly as close as you will get. I also got it in this magenta color. I got the sports bra in the same color. I don't have anything to pair with this. I mean, I can pair it with, like, black leggings or something. But something about having matching workout sets makes me feel powerful. And it makes me feel like my life is together. You know? Like, it's just something about matching sets just... And then last but not least for the workout set, I got this gray one. And I really like the style of the bra, the sports bra. And this is just what it looks like. It's light gray. I don't own a lot of light gray leggings. I don't know why. And it is a racer back. I don't know if I should have gotten a bigger size. But this one is one of those leggings that has a little singe on the butt. But it just like didn't fit right on me. I don't know if it's because I got a size too small. Or I just need to size up. Or maybe it's just a product. I don't know what it is. But I do really like the material and the style. However, the back part just didn't sit right with me. I was like, what? There's something off about this. Like, it, it would have been a perfect workout set. I wasn't swooning over the back area. I got a couple of accessories. So I'm going to start off with my favorite, favorite, favorite item, guys. It is so cute. I got this cow print bucket hat. What? It's not black and white, it's brown and white. It's neutral and white, and it is so cute. I would wear it right now, but my pony is gonna get ruined. The cool thing about this bucket hat is that if it's too big on you, there's actually like a string on the back that you can adjust. Um, but like, can we just talk about how cute this is? Like a lot of people are super into like cow prints right now, and like this is a step up to the, you know, to the basic like black and white cow print. And it's just cute. It's super, super, super soft, you guys. It's like a little fur. It's like faux fur. Speaking of hats, I picked up a beanie because I currently have one or two beanies right now that I use when I go work out. So I want a neutral one. And it's just like this black knit one. And yeah, so if you guys ever see me wearing this when I'm at the park, it's from Shein. It's honestly pretty cute. And then some accessories that I got, I got this pair of earrings and these are so beautiful this one just reminds me of like ice princess like have you guys seen that disney movie called ice princess she was a very studious girl and then she like found out that her passion was ice skating and her mom was like no like i need you to like focus on your studies which honestly feels like that's that's all asian parents telling us not to take up arts so one is like moon the other one is like sun and it has like this topaz. Is this topaz? I don't know if topaz is blue, but it's just like this really nice ocean blue color and I cannot wait. Now, I don't know where I'm gonna wear this, but if I ever do need to like 
stunt. This is my go-to. This is my go-to. Then I also picked up this booty band. I got this because I have, I mean, I have a booty band, but I wanted something cute. So I just got this, and this one has like lips and tongues on the freaking design. And it says Vigor Plus. I don't know if they had sizes on these, but this is just what it looks like. And it honestly looks promising. It doesn't feel cheap. So I'm excited. I'm gonna be wearing this, or I'm gonna be using this in one of my workout vlogs. So stay tuned. And then last but not least, I picked up this bag. Now this bag is honestly not the greatest quality. It's pretty cheap. Um, I believe this was like, I don't know, like less than $20. And I wanted it because the marble is just so pretty, but when I like touched it, I was like, uh, uh. Like it's okay, it's okay. Like I wouldn't recommend this. Don't get this, don't get this. They have better quality bags than Shein, not this one, not this one. So skip on this one. So we have reached the end of our clothing haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. As always, I will have all the product links down below and you can use my code q 3 beauty 15 Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button below because I have lots of really, really fun plans for you guys for Vlogmas. And hint, hint, I will have a giveaway every single week during Vlogmas season. Every single week, not every single day, every single week. So, yeah, anyways, you didn't hear from here, you didn't hear from here. Anyways, I love you guys so, 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 so much, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!